How y'all doing? This Trucker Taylor here. And um, right now, I'm in um, Texas right now. Just uh, woke up. Ugh. I was knocked out of this, this pilot truck stop, bro. Knocked out. Well, I had a long day yesterday. I was tired as fuck. Yeah, man. I was like, literally, like, I don't know, man. Like, <laughs> these. These forklift guys at these companies, man, have no urgency, dog. Like, take their time. Like, I was at this company, the, the, the steel, I guess, the steel mill or something like that, where they make the steel coils and all that. And, um, because, um, I basically got steel plates on my trailer right now. So, um, I get there. And then, like, I basically pull in. I pull into the um to to the check-in spot because you basically got to hop on the scale, and and they weigh you before anything is loaded on your trailer. They they weigh they they, they basically weigh your whole tractor and your trailer and all that. So I get weighed in, and then um after you get weighed in, you check in at the office, whatever. You talk to the lady, and then she she basically told me to go to bay three. And just wait behind one of the trucks that's already getting loaded. I'm like, oh, okay, okay. So I basically I pull pull my truck in around where Bay Three is at. Oh my, oh my eyes are itching. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, but um, I basically pull I, I basically pull behind the truck in Bay Three, and then um, I'm just waiting for the truck to finish getting loaded, you know, whatever. So he finished getting loaded, right? Okay, and then um, the guy, the guy, the guy that's loading him, he just leaves. Like, like, like he just like, um, I'm just gonna take a little, take a 45 minute smoke break. Like, he was literally gone. Like, he didn't come back for like 45 minutes. He took a 45 minute smoke break. And then like, I'm just, I'm still waiting, right? And then like. Another hour, like an hour pass, and I'm like, dude, like, like, where you at? Like, he just rolls out, like. And then, like, 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 I, I, go, I go check, I go check out, like, like, basically check back in with the lady, and I'm like, is um everything good? Cause um the guy, the guy that was loading the trailer, he just left. I don't. He was loading someone else in front of me, and he just left. So what's going on? And he was like, he was like, oh. Yeah, he, he he usually you know does what he wants because um he's basically the only guy that can load you so he he kind of he kind he kind of has a relaxed schedule. I was like, well, I got places to be. I can't just just waste time just because his ass can just do whatever he wants. Like, it doesn't work like that. Like, what kind of business are you trying to run? <laughs> I mean, time is money. I got places to be. I ain't got time to just bullshit around. <laughs> you know? So, so I'm like, I'm like, okay, okay, well, I'm just going back there and wait again. I wait like, I mean, I mean, I, mean, I wait about like another 20 minutes and the guy comes back. And then, um, he just like puts like one more one more uh, steel plate or something on his truck, like one, like like one more piece, and then the guy leaves, and then I pull up, and then like I'm sitting there, and then the guy leaves again. Like I'm trying to figure out like where you go, cause like I'm uh, like I, I pull into the bay, and I'm just sitting there waiting, and I'm like, okay, where where did you go? Like, and then he just leaves for like another 30, 30 minutes. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, um, where are you going? And he was like, he was like, yeah, I'm about to go, about to go take another smoke. <laughs> I'm like, dude, 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 dude. <laughs> and he takes a smoke break. I'm like, there's nothing I can do. Like, I, like, like, I, like, I can't go off on him. He's a forklift guy. He's the only one. So if I go off on him, he he, he can easily. Be like, 
fuck you. Uh, I'm going to take even longer this time now to load you. Okay? <laughs> he, uh, he has that power. He's the only one there. He's the only one. So, so I'm, I'm literally at his mercy. So, I, I, like, he, he takes, like, another 35 minutes, like, a 30, 35 minute smoke break. Again. It just takes smoke break. And then, and then he starts loading me, right? He, he, he gets, like, halfway done and then stops again. And just, and just goes, goes outside and bullshits with his buddies. Dude. <laughs> what are you doing? I need to get out of here. I got things to do. <laughs> okay. Like, it literally, okay, like, like sh long story short, I was there six hours yesterday. Six hours. From the time that I got there to the time I finished getting loaded. There, six hours, bro. <laughs> six hours. So, yeah, so, man, I'm telling you, these forklift guys, man, they have no urgency. They don't care. They basically get to go home every day. They get to go home every day. Like, like they basically got to worry about the clock and, and, and you know, and, and it's a struggle to make it to the truck stop so you can sleep, you know, and take a shower and all that. Like, they don't care about all that, you know. They don't. And and I think some of them they, they just they just don't like they just don't understand like that you got 14 hours you could be on duty. I don't think they really care about that. Like I mean I I, I know some of the Fort Lee guys they probably understand that you know that that time is kind of precious to us and you know and it's important for us to um, really manage our time. So if you if you slacking off. And you take six hours to load us, you kind of screwed us over, you know. Cause um, I barely had time to make it to the truck stop, barely. Like like once he, once he loaded me, like I I, bar I literally had probably about twenty like twenty eight minutes left on my clock. And thank God I was close to a pilot. I was literally like twelve miles away, so so I could take a shower and everything, cause. Went like two days. I take a shower, boy. It was rough, <laughs> boy, man. But um, yeah, just just, just know that um, these fort some sometimes these fort lift guys, man, they don't care. They'll take six, eight hours sometimes, you know. And and and, and I mean sometimes it's not their fault. You know, I mean, I mean, most time you you in and out of here quick, you know, for the most part. But every now and then you get that one company, man, that just don't care. <laughs> they they take that precious time because they just hate their, they basically hate their situation, that they hate their job, and they're just not happy. So they're gonna make your life a living hell, also. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I just want to rant about that. But y'all, um, y'all take it easy. God bless y'all. Peace.